Hey everybody, Scott Pierce here at Listings to Leads. And this ad that you're looking at generated 89 leads, 31 cents a lead, giving name, email, phone number, and buying timeframes. All right, so when people click through this ad, they're gonna go to your Listings to Leads single property website automatically. So if you got video, awesome. And the great thing about these leads is, so these are probably mostly buyer leads, but check this out. So first of all, you're gonna get a lot of great buyer leads when the market changes, you're gonna have all those buyers, but there's a lot of places in here for uh, homeowners to put in their property address, for example, to get a PDF guide on the buying or selling process. And check this out. When people go to download these guides, they're prompted to uh, answer, do you own a home? Yes or no. And do you need to sell your home before you buy a new one? to get the guides, all right? So there's a lot of opportunity to generate both buyer leads and seller leads with all of these ads that you're doing listing to leads. So I'm gonna show you two different ways to do these ads from listing to leads. One is where you're gonna do it yourself in about five seconds. And the other one is where it's fully automated from the MLS, all right? So first of all, to do a Facebook and Instagram ad using listing to leads to capture name, email, phone number, and selling or purchase timeframes, Go to the listings page in your listings to leads account and get the listing. So in this case, it was a just listed listing where he generated 89 leads at 31 cents each. So I'm going to click market listing, the green button there. It'll put me right in the workspace where I need to be at to do the ad. So you can see here, create ad and location already pre-filled. I can change that. We got special housing ad category. We got a lifetime budget of $35 for one week. All of this is completely editable. If you've got a video, so if you've got a property video, a walkthrough video, uh, what have you, you can click that blue button and click upload, upload the video, and it will appear in the ad. All right, so it'll, re it'll literally replace this here. You can always retarget if you want to, but all you gotta do is click the green create ad button. All right, so literally click the green market listing button, Confirm the location, the budget, the time, and all of that. Upload a video if you got it. There's other more advanced things that you can do. Here you can see a couple of my ads with videos. And there you go. That ad is going to be sent to Facebook for review. It's going to be live here pretty shortly. All of that without going to the Facebook ads manager. So exclusive leads. There's no overcharges or anything like that. All the budget goes to the ad itself. And once you get here, there's a view button and you can click it and go view the ad. And it can take 15 to 20 seconds for that link to be live. So here's my preview. And now I can go click show ad. And we'll go look at the ad. That's usually a couple of posts down. And there we go. So there's our ad. People click the ad and there we go. Name, email, phone number, and buying timeframe. So all of you are coming soon. You just listed active open house. Your pending and just holds all work the same way, all right? It's literally that easy to do an ad for Facebook and Instagram and listing to leads. So the other way is to fully automate this from the MLS, all right? So check this out. Again, in my listings page, click settings, and there's a tab here called ads, and I can just turn this on. It'll be off when you first get there. I can turn it on, and then I can say, give me a, uh, monthly budget of no more than $300. Now, if you go over that, we'll stop the ad and then send you a notification to come in here and change it if you want to, but it's a nice control. And then automatically run ads for all of these statuses by default. So every time I have a listing, whether it's coming from the MLS or I change the status in listing to leads or add it in listing to leads, we will automatically run an ad, all right, for you, capturing name, email, phone number, purchase selling timeframes. All right, automatically drop it into your listings to leads follow-up or send it to your CRM automatically so that you're following up with all these leads automatically 100% of the time, all right? So, and then I can say lastly here, do no more than 10 ads a week, all right? And again, if you hit the 300, if you hit the 10, we're gonna uh, send you an email to notify you that you hit your limit. And if you wanna come in here and edit that upwards, but it's nice to have a control Nobody wants to get a $4,000 Facebook bill at the end of the month as a surprise. That's not a good kind of surprise that we're looking for, all right? We want leads, we want them fast, and we want them good. And this is a phenomenal way to make sure that that's gonna happen, whether you come in here and do these ads yourself, or you set up for automation, 
you're going to get a lot of high quality leads. So if you have any questions, ask listings to lead support and we'll talk to you soon.